In a previous video, we learnt about isotopes. Here are a few more examples. There are two isotopic forms of chlorine, chlorine-35 and chlorine-37. Remember, isotopes have the same number of protons, but a different number of neutrons. So how many neutrons are in each isotope of chlorine? Remember, mass number equals number of protons plus number of neutrons and the number of protons in each isotope is the same. Therefore, we can rearrange this formula to calculate the number of neutrons in each form. Neutrons equals mass number minus protons. When we look at chlorine on the periodic table, it has an atomic number of 17. Therefore, it has 17 protons. So chlorine 35 has a mass of 35. Neutrons equals mass number minus protons. 35 minus 17, 18 neutrons. So chlorine 37 has a mass of 37. Neutrons equals mass number minus protons. 37 minus 17, 20 neutrons. So chlorine 35 has 18 neutrons and chlorine 37 has 20 neutrons. Another example of an isotope is lithium. Lithium has two stable isotopic forms. The atomic number of lithium is 3, therefore it has 3 protons. The isotopes of lithium have 3 neutrons and 4 neutrons respectively. How do we calculate each of the isotopes' mass numbers? Remember, mass number equals number of protons plus number of neutrons. So for one isotopic form, the mass number would be 3 plus 3, 6. So we would have Li6. And for the other form, the mass would be 3 plus 4 equals 7. So we would have Li7.